just in the evening, three or four of us, friends, sitting out there, eating those hot from the kadai samosas, drinking that tea, and unfiltered charminar cigarettes. That, that is the, the memory that, that, that really lingers on. Preparing for the exams and chatting the whole nights. I hadn't done it uh, before coming to this. And there it was a matter of routine. Either chatting up or reading up novels or studying for exams. Look, uh, Karnat was very well known for uh, Volgas. They had this uh, fantastic uh, uh, Rasmalai. Yeah. They are definitely the best Rasmalai in the world. Yeah. Sitting in the modas and not sipping chai is the best. Yeah. On hindsight, now I realize that the education I got at BITS was more complete. The whole package of learning that you get from BITS is unique. You won't get it anywhere else. The first day you land up there, you know, you're told that you, know, you make your own timetable. You decide which courses you've got to, uh, you want to take up. And uh, that's a bit of a shock actually. <laughs> and, uh, you know, that immediately teaches you uh, responsibility and independence. Go to dad and he said the most beautiful thing which is the greatest truth ever. He said, why do you think I sent you to Bits Pilani? He said, I said, you sent me there to study, Pa. He said, no, I sent you there to learn about life. And I think this is your first lesson. Face it, that's it. In the middle of the lecture, he will pull up his shirt and inside it, he has all the quiz papers. You normally have this divide between student and professor and I think uh, some, if not all of those professors, managed to breach that divide and really kind of open themselves up to the students. Uh, and that's inspiring. But the professors, since they were living on campus, it was very convenient for them to go to college back and they would always be available for us also. You could even very often visit them at home if you had an issue. So it was, a, it was like a family, you know, and that also made a big difference for all of us. But I think Pilani teaches us one thing, you know, academics is important, but uh, the ten point is never going to be the most successful guy in life. Culturally, the professors were all universally cool. And um, so there was that universe. And then there was this whole extracurricular thing, um, which were all student organized. I think which Pirani changed my life, uh, that's for sure. You know, I think the one important uh, attitude which, which Pilani trained puts in you is that, you know, flexibility and freedom comes with the price, which is responsibility and accountability. If today, if what I am today is what it's taught me. I mean, I've always believed that people who go to Pilani are much, much better at adjusting to um, kind of uncontrollable externalities. The BITS graduate comes in all flavors. So you don't have to worry about the fact that everybody you see from BITS is a single flavor. So what you find is you will see the entrepreneur, you will see the uh, manager, you will see the professional, you will see the CEO, and you will see the engineering geek. A large part of who I am today, a large part of what I am today, uh, a large part of how I think, how I write, uh, how I manage people, how I react to others, are all things that I learned in BITS. What I really developed into from here was that it made me very resourceful, very, very tough, and very innovative. So these are the three things I think made a difference for me. BITS produces guys who can take on multinationals. It makes a man out of you. You know, five years of your formative life get spent there with people who love and give you a sweat and blood for. You develop that sense of pride in yourself and again balancing it with a sense of humility because you are surrounded with everybody who is excellent. I think that what Pilani gives you is that ability and that opportunity to truly find yourself. What BITS does is it sets the circumstance for you to become what you want to be. And I think that's the power. The power really is allowing you to express yourself, allowing you to express your individual creativity, along with all of this information that has to be drilled into you if you're gonna go get a degree from Bitch Pilani. <laughs>